what's up we're back in the jungle well not a real jungle but protected beach area we're gonna look at some uh man i can't speak properly today we're gonna look for some isopods legend has it uh that have kubaris murica here or murica uh cool little isopods if you don't know what isopod is you're gonna find out okay isopods are tiny crustaceans um, I guess you guys know them as pill bugs or Raleigh polys or whatever, or wood lice. And since they're crustaceans, they breathe through modified gills. Luckily for us, it rained this morning, so the moisture in the air is very high. So hopefully they'll be active and we'll see a bunch of them. I have a feeling they're here under this log. Let's lift it up and see if we can catch them. Oh yeah, of course, I, uh, I brought a container. Let's see. Hmm, nothing so far. I have a feeling if we uh, lift the litter, they'll be in there. Ooh, there's some like weird centipedes. I'm just gonna dump a few here in the container so you guys can see them. And no isopods yet. Surprisingly, a lot of people keep them as pets in an aquarium. Well, I guess not an aquarium, terrarium. So, I can't really blame them, man. These guys are really cute. Let's just, um, we just catch some. Ooh, I got a tiny one. Let's see if we can get a bigger one. Ooh, that's a good one. I got it. I got one. Look, I found one. Ah, cute little guy. He's gonna go in a bucket. <clears throat> see, these guys are really cute. Let's see if we can catch, catch some more. Wow, those guys are really quick. I got some more, but they're quick. Ah, they're quick. Damn it. Ooh. Here's another one. Cool deal. I knew we'll find them. There's got to be more of them here. Let's move over there. There's a bunch of uh, old coconuts and I have a feeling um, we'll see some more crustaceans under them. Well, this is really cool. Uh, the coconuts are actually starting to root. It's like I keep seeing a lot of them, but they're really tiny. I want a, I want nice fat ones. All right, we're out of the jungle, and you guys get to see all the cool isopods, Kubaris, Murica. Let's watch. Ah, oh, they're stuck in there. Let me get them out. Uh, and um, I'm not sure what these guys are. I thought it was a centipede, but it seems like it likes rotten wood, and I don't know. It doesn't even let, have legs, so some sort of worm. I'm gonna release them. Well, actually, we'll be releasing all the animals, so don't worry. 
Let's shake him out. Come on. Aren't these guys cool? Come on, you can unroll. No one's gonna hurt you. Pretty neat, huh? You can totally tell why people keep them as pets. So cute. Look at their little antenna. And this is like a really fat one. I'm guessing these are like young adults. Come on, don't don't roll up. You can totally fall in love with these guys. So cute. You know, out of all the crustaceans, I think isopods kind of like got a short end of the stick. Uh, they're not as famous as crabs or shrimps or even lobsters. But personally, I think they're just as cute. You can tell how big this guy is. I guess he's big for uh, for an isopod, or land isopod. Obviously, there are giant marine isopods, but those are really seen. This guy is a pretty large compared to other ones, especially to European ones, because you know, in Europe we have tiny ones. Mm, there's another one. All right, and there's scoop right here with a worm. All right, well, we're gonna release them all so they won't get any more stressed. And I'm going to the beach. <laughs>